All right, we'll miss a day or even a segment of the 208. No problem. You can catch us every day on our YouTube channel, or if you're stuck in traffic like you would be right about now, wanted something to listen to while you drive, we've got good news. Our shows will be available in podcast form on all platforms like Spotify, Apple Podcasts. So look for it for this show, especially after this show. Don't forget to join our 208 Facebook group. Until you do that, though, let's take a look at some of your comments right now. This one sent in uh, from CJ. We just voted. There were several names of people running against Trump. Who are they and why haven't you heard anything uh, about them from you? Well, there's a long list of candidates, not the official candidate. Uh, people like Rocky De La Fuente, Bob Eli, Matthew John Matern, Donald J. Trump, Joe Walsh, Bill Weld. A lot of those people are just kind of on a ballot. A lot of people dropped out, not necessarily still campaigning, not in the race but they're still on the ballot. So there's a reason that we just kind of, they're just there. Just like a lot of the Democratic Party, like Cory Booker, still on the Democratic side of the primary as well. Uh, next question, next comment sent in. This one from Betty M. Tell me how the girl was able to get into the state house with a loaded gun. I thought people were screened for weapons before getting in. They are not. In fact, the state house, you can walk in with a gun. Some of our legislators carry guns with them to their office. And when they have some of these, uh, protests or I should say uh, rallies when it comes to the Second Amendment. They come in with guns. Not sure if they're all loaded or not, but no, you can carry a concealed weapon or not concealed into the state house because that's the rule everywhere across the state. So thanks for your question. 208, a little confused on the Oregon legislature store uh, story. Isn't this a even year 2020? Yes, Jim, we kind of make this a conversation and sometimes my thoughts get ahead of what I'm trying to say. Yes, it is an even year. Even year is the year that they have a shortened, condensed version of the Oregon legislature, a 35 day session. That is this year. It's the odd years that they have the full session, which still is not a very long one as well. I want news about Idaho, not Oregon. Dorothy, well, it's all part of it. They're in our viewership. In fact, Ontario uh, and Vail, all in our viewership. So we kind of want to incorporate everybody into the 208. We just got comfortable with no tie, and now a tie. Get rid of it. Too businesslike for the 208. We just don't want you to get too comfortable.